moving from the country being such a small sort of place and then moving into the big city with all the opportunities at your feet. Her debut was a local derby, so that was pretty special. He flies for it, makes a good catch as well, the 19-year-old Stapleton. A few highlights throughout the career was you know, scoring four tries in one game. That was a moment that I'll never forget as well. He'll go all the way, Nathan Stapleton, four tries he scores. What a day out for Nathan Stapleton. It was just a normal day. My wife's brother and I were driving to the game and we weren't expecting anything to happen. It was just a normal game of footy. I'm pretty sure it was in the first half of the game. I don't re remember the incident as such, um, but it was just an awkward tackle that sort of, it was sort of no one's fault. It was just one of those things that just freak accident. My first memory was sort of I heard voices. I wasn't sure who they were at first. And then my wife, Kate, came in and she was talking to me and I, and I just recognised it, sort of clicked. And um, yeah, and I suppose that was a massive relief for her as well. Like it was daunting, wasn't it? In my injury in suburbia was 2% survival rate. I was, I was in the middle of nowhere, so um, it was, quite frightening. Louise was a local to the area. On the day, she recognised early on that I was in trouble um, and she proceeded to do CPR. Uh, I was pronounced dead on the scene for 16 minutes and um, she never gave up. So her perseverance and her dedication to not only her job, but to me, was uh, unfathomable. And she was the only reason why I'm, I'm alive today. They're the light to our days every day. We wake up and they're, they're so happy and they love each other and they I mean the absolute world to me. My wife Kate, she's done so much for me. She's a rock of this family. Without her, I wouldn't have got through this. Us as a family, we get to spend time on somewhere we've always dreamt of having. I wake up every day with a purpose and we've just got a small block of land here. We we'll just have a few sheep on the farm and I can do everyday tasks. I can use a computer just like a normal person, just using my head, not my hands, which is crazy to think. But without it, I wouldn't be independent. The recovery has been difficult. Coming to terms with, you know, what my new life is. Try time and a celebration to suit the occasion. Try July will be instrumental in funding my rehabilitation with medical bills and FES bike. The NRL have been absolutely fantastic, in particular the Cronulla Sharks. They have been instrumental in my recovery, um, not only financial, but mentally, and just knowing that They've showed that much support towards um, myself and my family and just knowing that we're not in this journey alone, that they're there for no matter what we need, knowing that we've got their support has made this journey just so much easier. Nathan Stapleton, how damn good it is to hear from him uh, there with his family and been through so much. And Rue, Joey, it's a time at the moment uh, with both he, Daniel Anderson, it's been confronting to see two people that live and breathe rugby league faced with such a life that they are now. But the rallying of the rugby league community we've seen earlier tonight, Try July with Sportsbet, uh, the family of league as well through the foundation, they're looking after them and there's lunches. I know there's one tomorrow for Daniel Anderson as well that are happening right around. We shouldn't be surprised, I guess. No, and that's one thing with rugby league communities. We know whenever things get tough, everyone will rally around those people. And I think it's wonderful, especially what family of league do. They go out of their way to help previous players and families of players who have hit hardships or have had significant injuries and they try and help them as much as they possibly can and it is wonderful to see the community rally around them the way they do and just listening to him speak was mm. 
very humbling just to hear how grateful he is for what he has and his family and for what the community does for him. It's just so sad seeing that. Uh, we saw a couple of years ago when Alex McKinnon mm -hmm. had his uh, horrendous injury and the rise for Alex and the way the rugby league community, everyone just rallied around Alex and we'll see it again. So, you know, terrible story, uh, terrible. Most certainly is. Um, well done to everyone doing their bits, uh, of course, as well. Mate